Hi everyone, it's April 20th, 2012, and I'm in Istanbul, Turkey right now. And I forgot what the name of this place is. It might be part of the Hagia Sophia. But these are absolutely the most colorful tulips I have ever seen. And I can tell just by looking at the screen that they're not really being done justice right now. They're a pink that I have never seen. And I'm told that for a long time, tulips were considered bad luck here because of the tulip mania that happened in the 1600s. Many of you may be aware of what happened, but basically, well, I only know a truncated version of it myself. But when the Netherlands became really interested in the market of tulips, there was sort of a commodity craze with them. And sometimes bulbs went for uh, millions of guilders, actually, in the Netherlands. It, it was really quite disruptive. Oh, I, I really wish you could be here right now to see the detail. It's just astounding, really. And it does not cost anything to, to enter this zone, at least not in the early evening hours. There was some kind of a security office And this looks like it could go pretty much indefinitely around. I'm not going to do that because I'm extremely hungry. Now I'll give you a little bit of an off the beaten path one. Now, Istanbul does have four seasons. However, you can see by the plant life that it slightly favors the Mediterranean climate and supports some palm trees, some of the, the many ones. But over here we have some kind of huge cedar, which I believe that's the tree of Lebanon. So it's kind of endemic to this area. Really nothing to report as of this time. I extended my uh, reservations in Istanbul for three more days beyond the initial three day set. I'm just kind of getting a feel for things before I progress with another deal, potential deal in this area. I very much like what I have seen so far, but anytime it's if you it's difficult for anyone to go into an unfamiliar place, but once you've done it a few times, you know what it's going to take and how far you have to go to really get a grasp of what's happening and since I've been through it before in Denmark and Korea and Canada I can anticipate <laughs> what it would take and I'm not sure that I really want to do that uh, thanks for watching bye